fine, Nimmel. Nice to see you. Uh, you were with me during my worst days in life, I can say. And now nice to see you again when I am better. Okay. Now it's far better. That day, um, I was not at home. I was away. And then the news was so shocking. I have to say my heart was in my mouth when I heard that. And I was just running. I didn't know what to do. Then I knew everything is gone. I, I was uh, so shocked that I can say I didn't cry. Then I didn't have any feeling, I can say. And when I went inside, almost it was dark, no electricity. Couldn't see anything, only black color. And all the things were burned and it was just ash. Yes. The Red Crescent was the people who told me that they want to see the place. And then they came to school, I can remember, and from school we went to that burnt place. Very nice. That is what they were very polite and very soft spoken and very comforting their talk was. So caring. As if I know them before. That, that is what uh, was. Uh, then I, even now I am disclosing everything to you because I feel that you are mm, somebody very close to me. And then uh, the same way I understood how I should be to others when they are in a critical condition. Good people, my school people, my colleagues, then moreover you Red Crescent people, very supportive for me. I didn't know anybody else. You were the ones who came. I can say there should be uh, such organizations like Red Crescent Maldives. We should have an organization like this with such sweet people.